Hi, Mr. Buffett. This is Matthew Lai from China, Hong Kong. My question is, besides the electrical car company, BRD, under what circumstances you will reinvest and reconsider to invest Hong Kong and China company? Thank you. Well, our primary investments will always be in the United States. Uh, we do think it. Now, the companies we invest in, in the United States, American Express does business around the world, and no company hardly does business around the world like Coca-Cola. I mean, uh, they are the preferred soft drink. You know, something maybe like 170 or 180 out of 200 companies, uh, 200 countries. Those are rough approximations from a few years back, probably. But, but that degree of acceptance worldwide is, I think it's, Almost unmatched. I can't really think of any company that has it. American Express has a position in the credit card deal, which I think is extremely strong. And part of that was one of the direct part of the reasons for that is one of the directors that I introduced a few a few minutes ago, Ken Chanel. But it 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 is it has strengthened dramatically over the last twenty years for a lot of reasons. Uh, so we will, uh, the, the BYD investment was a, uh, and, and well, we, we made them, we made the commitment in Japan, which I did five years ago. And, and that was just overwhelmingly, was compelling. It was extraordinarily compelling. And we put, we bought it as fast as we could. And we spent a year and. You know, we got a few percent of our assets in five very big companies, but that's the problem of being our size. But you won't find us making a lot of investments uh, outside the United States, although we're participating through these other companies in the world economy. Uh, but I understand the United States rules, weaknesses, strengths, <laughs> whatever it may be, <coughs> I... I don't, I don't have the same feeling for, for uh, economies generally out, uh, around the world. I don't, I don't pick up on other cultures extremely well. And, and the lucky thing is I don't have to because, you know, I don't live in some tiny little country that has no, uh, just doesn't have a big economy, but I'm in an economy already that has, you know, after starting out with a, Half a percent of the world's population has ended up with well over 20 percent of the world's output in, in an amazingly short period of time. So, so I we will we will be American oriented. Uh, uh, I mean, if if we do something really big, it's extremely likely to be in the United States. Charlie, in all those years, there's only two times he's told me that you know this one is really you know. It, he, he would he would always go along with me and, you know, and say, well, when I was suggesting something, he'd say, well, this is really not that great, but but it's probably the best you'll come up with. So <laughs> I'll go along with the idea. Uh, that, uh, but Charlie Charlie twice has pounded the table with me and just said, you know, bye, bye, bye. And uh, BYD was one of them, and, and Costco was the other. And uh, we bought a certain amount of Costco, and we bought quite a bit of BYD. But looking back, uh, I, so he already was, was aggressive, but I should have been more aggressive uh, in, in Costco. It wasn't fatal that we weren't, but, but he was right big time in both companies. I'm aware of what goes on in most markets, but I think it's unlikely that we make any large commitments uh, in almost any country you can name, although, you know, we don't rule it out entirely. And uh, I feel extremely good about our Japanese position, and we'll have that, uh, um, I don't know how many years. Greg will be sitting with that at some point, and we couldn't be happier with that. But you really have to, we really have a different outlook in looking at, well, we look at your money, which we couldn't bear to lose, and we feel that we we're very 
less likely to make any truly major mistakes in the United States than in many other countries.